I'm back. Well, hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. It's been a hot minute since I've done an aerial video like this where it's just a hand video, but I have been wanting to do this project for so long. Um, it all stems from this container. I am gonna show you how I am going to make this a really wonderful travel container for either your purse, the office, or your car. Um, just something on the go. This I actually purchased at Joanne Fabrics, uh, my local Joanne Fabrics, and on the side it says, Craftmates Lockables. Um, I don't have any other information than that, but um, yeah, if I can find a link, I will link it down below. Really neat thing about this is there is a little um, button right here, and when you push it, like, you can't open this normally, so when you push it down, then it unlocks these. So it's really nice so you're not worried about if you throw it in your you know, bag or your diaper bag or something that your pills are all gonna go flying, which I think is a really, really nice feature. So anyways, let's get on to the project. First of all, I have my little brother, P-Touch. I have already created my labels, but this is the label maker that I use. If I can find it, I will link it down below. And um, I just wrote out all of the different things that I want to put in here. Um, what I want to use this for is more like everyday kind of a use. So I wanted some Advil and Tylenol. Also some Tums if you eat something that just isn't agreeing with your body. And then also some like cold and flu kind of things. Um, I have these, these are like the Oscillium. I think that's how you say it. Um, but these are like a little dissolvable thing you put on your tongue and it helps with like cold and flu stuff. I've got some throat drops, also some Dayquil, and these are just some like non-drowsy, cold cough pressure kind of medicines that I'm gonna put in here as well. So everything here is okay like to drive with, I guess, was kind of my main motivation with it, because I wanted this to be um, like something that was like more on the go, so yeah. All right, oh, I shouldn't have done that first, hold on. It's not a true Emily video if she hasn't already messed it up. <laughs> so I wanted to grab my scissors, which is right here, which by the way, um, a long time ago, I stole them from my mom. They have her initials on here. <laughs> Sorry, mom. Um, anyways, so I wanted to kind of just trim down these little things. Like this one says Tums. Can we see? Is it gonna focus? It probably won't. My camera's having so many issues focusing lately. But this one says Tums, so I'm gonna put it, you know, wherever it goes. But I think my most used things would be like the Advil and Tylenol, so I think I'm gonna put those in the first two, and then the Tums, and then it's gonna go into like, kind of more cold and flu kind of stuff. So, um, I actually got these in the travel section at Target, and um, I can put links below for you guys, but I think you can probably handle finding your own stuff that would work for you. Um, so yeah. I mean, these little capsules are great, but when you want more than just this, it's, you know, kind of nice to have it all in one space. And I'm just gonna put this in my, like either my glove compartment or my like center console, cause I don't really have much in there at the moment. Oh, what am I doing? Seriously. <laughs> Let's get this all unpackaged. All right, cool. All right, so Advil is kind of my like number one. So I'm gonna just trim this baby down. I'm just gonna put it at the bottom there. See, Advil, beautiful. All right, and then where am I at now? Tylenol, Tylenol's kind of my like second most used item in here. Um, I prefer Advil, it just works better with my body typically, but every once in a while I'm with somebody that wants a Tylenol versus an Advil, so yeah. And obviously you can label these any way you want. This just is what I have on hand and I wasn't gonna like buy anything, so yeah. I was kind of thinking about, I mean you guys can do this too, but I was kind of thinking about like printing off the like label of it and putting it in here. I thought that would be like really cute, but then I thought about it and I just really wanna see how much is in there so I know what to replenish 
and um, if I was gonna do kind of like the method I was thinking of I wouldn't be able to see like how many like Tums are left or how many Tylenols are left so I kind of wanted to see into my package but I don't know I thought that would be like a cool idea all right so and then after that I'm gonna start like my cold and flu stuff so this is that acilium I think it's what it's called um, one of my friends actually got me hooked on this stuff and it actually works pretty well um, I think so I'm gonna put it in there again it's like a non drowsy thing thing it's a non drowsy thing oh my gosh I cannot talk today and then we'll put in some cough drops and these can be any cough drops obviously I just have some Luden's ones on hand and figured I would just put those in there um, I did have some other cough drops that in my last bout of the sickness um i used up all the way so i figured i would just just use these and that's going to work wonderful for this purpose and it's going to be nice to just have this stuff on the go in the car um but i'm going to use mine for my car because as some of you know that have been following me for a little while i am don't have a job anymore so i don't need it for anything else but that and then this one has two different things. Oh no, it's not long enough. Um, boo. Here, we'll do this. We'll do just cold and cough, cause that's fine. Cause I understand. How am I gonna do this? Cause I don't like the negative space, you guys. I don't like it. Yuck. Okay, I think I got it. Non-drowsy, cold and cough. I'm so sorry if you guys can't see that. It's super overcast out today. So it's probably not like the best idea to start filming this today, but oh well, oh well. But I have the time, so I wanna get this, I wanna get this video up for you guys because I've had this like idea to do it for such a long time and I just haven't been able to do it because of, you know, time constraints. So now I'm just gonna fill up all of my little guys here. And I know I'm probably gonna get questions. I do not remember how much this little organizer was. Um, I would say it's probably more than $3, but like less than 10. But I, but I don't know, I don't know. And I don't know what I'll find on the internet after I load this video either. So, sorry. All right, looks like um, there is enough room for both of these to go in. Oh my gosh, I'm like on the struggle bus today. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> ah, all right. So all the Advil, wonderful. Pop my Tylenols in there. Oh, doesn't that look so satisfying? <laughs> I'm, I'm satisfied about it. All right, and these are Tums and Acid. These are the smoothies. Oh, it's got like a little seal for my protection. I don't want to be protected anymore. I want to open. All right. There we go. Oh, there's more. Ah, come here. Oh. When two of them are trying to come out at the same time. Very cool. And like this little package fit perfectly in here, just FYI. Also satisfying. Here's my Ocillion some 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 sums. I know I'm saying that wrong, you guys. I just know it. All right. Let's put a few cough drops in here. Probably not gonna be able to fit that many in here just because, you know, whatever. But this is just like in a pinch kind of a situation. Come on, come on. There we go. You gotta talk nice to it to <laughs> let it do what you want. All right, and then should I leave these in here? Or no? Let's see if they fit. Oh yeah, that fits, okay, perfect. And then these are the non-drowsy ones, which I think can stay in here as well, maybe. Yes, yes, oh, I'm so excited. So that was my quick and easy little project I wanted to share with you guys. Again, whatever I can find, I will link it down below. Just to go over one more time, I did Advil, Tylenol, Tums, Ocilinum, num, 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 <laughs> cough drops, Dayquil, and some non-drowsy, like cold cough pressure stuff. Um, so yeah, I am just so excited about this. And the nice thing is, like, 
I can try to open this up and it won't because there's that little lock on the side. So again, if I can find this specific container, I will link it for y'all. Maybe I should center this properly. Yeah, that looks better. So anyway, that is it for me. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really, really appreciate it. If you have any questions, feel free to post them down below. I'll get back to as many of you as I possibly can. Feel free to thumbs up the video if you liked it. If you have any video suggestions, feel free to put them down in the comments as well. Also make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Ready, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.